I can do better. What do you mean using system collections, generic system, numeric unity engine, vector three using? Hello fellow everybody, in case you haven't noticed, today's video is going to be a little different today. For those of you who don't know, I got my username Electronic Crafter because I like repairing electronics and making things with my own two hands. Well, for the past couple of years I've been working a project that is nearing completion. Kinda. Those of you who watch my TikTok lives might have heard a rumor that I might be making a video game. Well, I'm here to quench that rumor. It's not true. I am making a video game. Not might be making a video game. Am making a video game. Well, what's this video game about? Well, it's about you trying to avoid lines and circles. Trust me, it's fun. I just don't know how to explain it without giving it all away. And while I do have a title for it, for now, I just like to refer to it as Project CD. Well, for the last two years, I've been programming in C Sharp and learning to make a 2D phone game in Unity. Now, unfortunately, I can't show gameplay footage of it just yet, mainly due to the fact that I've been striving for more functionality over beauty, so I haven't gotten into the art direction of it just yet. I mean, just look at this. It looks like falling gummy worms. Do you really want this to haunt your dreams at night? Heck, I don't even know what I want the art style to look like. I got it! Now I'm not alone in this production. Fortunately, I've had a few people playtest it, and at least one person said it was fun. Hey, this is pretty fun. Don't patronize me! Now, I don't know the first thing about writing music, so that's where my friend Ethan Troy, aka DJ Logarithm, comes in. He's been writing the scores for Project CD for a while, and he's doing a really great job, and I look forward to showing it to you in the future. Now what I've been doing for the past few months is trying to figure out why the colliders aren't colliding. So for example, the problems that I've been dealing with are, how did the lines get out of the boundaries? That's illegal. Or, why are the lines crossing? That's illegal. Or, why am I not taking any damage? That's illegal. Or one time the enemy files got corrupted and deleted themselves. <laughs> Luckily I was able to re-import it all back in. And most recently, I haven't been able to get a button to work. The button ain't buttoning. Luckily, things seem to be going smoothly. And I've also been taking classes to learn how to program. Most recently, my recent class was learning with Python. Yes, I'm very aware that Unity uses C Sharp, but now I can get my MacBook to say hello to me. Hello. You're embarrassing yourself. Well, that's been the progress on Project CD, and we're hoping to get it out by the end of the year this year. However, lower your expectations on that. Again, I am only a single person who does not know how to program anything. But it has been my dream to be a video game designer, and it's almost done. So thank you guys very much for watching, and let me get your feedback on Project CD. I look forward to hearing from you guys, and um, thank you very much to DJ Logarithm for helping me out with the music. If it weren't for him, I don't think I would have been able to do this at all. So yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. Thank you again to DJ Logarithm, and let me know what you think. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys next time.